Well, some thought he had a bomb. Now he has an invitation to visit the White House. That about sums up a North Texas high school student's day after he took his invention to class. KXAN's Amanda Brandeis explains how he started out in handcuffs and is now getting so much support. I really don't know where I learned it from. Amin Mohammed says he wants to be an inventor and he's not wasting time making that happen. But his latest invention led to his arrest. I took it to school to show my teachers the talent that I had. I want to show them. And in my perspective, it didn't look like a bomb. He told a school resource officer it was a clock, but they said it was suspicious, taking him into custody. Ahmed was released, and it didn't take long for all the details to pop up on social media. What followed? Invitations usually reserved for the famous. Yeah. You going to the White House, my friend? Yes. <laughs> President Obama reached out, and so did Mark Zuckerberg of Facebook. And on Twitter, the hashtag I stand with Ahmed is trending. I never thought I'd get this far, but since I have gone this far, I will try my best not just to help me, but to help every other kid in the entire world who has a problem like this. As for the police, they say they acted out of caution. Obviously, we'll re review this as we do any high profile incident of any nature. Uh, but it evolved as it did because of the matter of safety and in the abundance of caution under the circumstances. Police dropped the charges and say the case is closed. As for Ahmed, he plans to change schools and keep inventing. Amanda Brandeis, KXAN News. Irving police, where this happened, also say they have an outstanding relationship with the Muslim community and they are committed to continuing to build on that.